Hello there, Nick Frankel here, and today we're going to be looking at the Hebrew letter Ches or Chet. Now, the structure of this letter, it's got the horizontal line across the top, and that's firmly sat on two legs, no gaps at all. That's the key detail about the letter Ches, that the horizontal line meets the two vertical lines and is completely supported. Now it makes this sound ch, where we don't have a single letter in English uh, to make that sound, but it's, it's familiar enough, especially in the Spanish J, like in uh, jalapeno or rioja. It's that back of the throat sound. Um, and in Hebrew, it's the beginning of the word chai, which means alive, and also chesed, which is loving kindness. It's the eighth letter of the Hebrew alphabet. It has a numerical value of 8. Now, in the deck of the Hebrew letters, I link it to the sign of Cancer the Crab. There's the glyph for the sign of Cancer the Crab, a water sign, so it's in blue. And in the Thoth Tarot deck, you can take a look at the box at the bottom of Tarot Trump 7, the chariot. And there you can see the letter Chet. It's, you have to look a little bit closely, but you can see that there are no gaps there. It's the same structure. And on the right-hand side is the glyph for the sign of Cancer, the crab. So what do we see? We'd expect to see on this card some crab-like imagery, as in the helmet that the fellow's wearing, the charioteer. The suit itself could be like the crab's shell. If you look carefully at the, the cuff, you can see the glyph for Cancer the Crab hidden in there. And because Cancer is the only sign of the zodiac that's ruled by the moon, it, its ruler travels through the zodiac very quickly in a, in a lunar month, a single lunar month. So perhaps the image of the speed of the chariot represents the moon's movement through the zodiac. That's the triangulation then. The letter Ches, the sign of Cancer the Crab, and Tarot Trump 7, the chariot. And if anyone's interested, the deck of the Hebrew letters devised by me, illustrated by James Douglas.